You guys want to see it? What's going on, everybody? Cloudy420 in the house today again, baby. We got something a little different for your asses today. Since Panini no longer has the license to UFC cards at the end of the year, I would like to show the new company, <coughs> Tops, hopefully, you sons of bitches, what I would like my dream set to look like. You know what I'm saying? So, we're going to start right here, guys. Base cards. My base cards, I want them to be the 2018 museum uh, design. They don't have to be as thick as the museum cards, but I like how clean it looks. It looks classy. It looks fucking sick. It's got some fucking shine to it. I fucking like it. I mean, and look at those pictures. Just the shots. Literally. We got friggin' uh, Overeem getting his head knocked off. To try to get a matchup with him. Got him! We got Usman, rookie card. We got smashing fucking uh, Maya in the face. Over here, Michael Johnson getting wrecked by Gaethje. Another rookie card. But that's what I would like my base set to look like. I would also like that base set to be 200 cards, guys. Past and present fighters. I don't want, like, a bunch of people I have no fucking idea who they are. Who the fuck is that? And 50 fucking rookies of people that are going to be packing groceries next week, all right? I want 180 of those base cards to be the best fighters of all time. We want the Royce Gracies, the Dan Severns, the... Uh, I don't know, I mean, he's not the greatest of all time, but he's got some, uh, you know, star power, Tank Abbott. Um, somebody got smart with me and uh, I had to lay the law down. I can't let people talk to me like that. We like all that shit, plus we want the friggin' Bo Nichols, the Anderson Silvas, the GSPs, John Jones, uh, whatever, you know, Chemayev, all the fucking new shit, we want all of them, 180, pack them in there, the last 20, we just want the best rookies, that's it, alright, that's a, no, no fucking grocery packers, just 20 of the best, I don't need fucking 50 off the contender series, you know what I'm saying? The parallels, guys, I would like 8. Eight is the key number, Panini. Not 50, you sons of bitches. What the fuck is going on? I don't need flash, silver, green, orange, uh, per blue, purple, red, disco, silver disco, flash, silver flash, gold flash, gold fucking uh, unicorn genitalia print, okay? What? Eight. And those eight will consist of... Two ninety nine silver, one ninety nine green, ninety nine orange, and seventy five blue. And now that's just the first four guys, but this here will give you an idea because I want the cards still to look like museum. So this would be an example. Blue, we'd have it to seventy five instead, but. You know, just around the border, do the blue, or, you know, work your fucking magic. Do some shit, you know what I'm saying? The next four parallels, guys, would be a red to 50. Then we would have the diamond refractor right in the middle, baby. Look at that shit. To 25. Then the X-fractor to 10. Also, I can't show you one because I don't have one. But Super Fractor would be my number one. Also, I'll just post one on the screen now. It's nice. And for the last one of one, I would like all the printing plates, guys. So there's usually three. So there'd be three one of one printing plates to go with it. Very nice. Next, guys, I would like three insert sets, 20 cards in each set, and I think we need to do some flags. Half the fighters come out to the uh, uh, octagon with their flag on, and UFC is such a global sport. Gotta have the flag insert, baby. Get that in the next insert set, guys, would have to be the octagon of honor. I mean, check that shit out. I mean, let it out, guys. Uh, 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 uh. Let that shit out. What's wrong with you? Fuck yeah, look at that shit. I mean, in a 20 card set, it'd be pretty hard to narrow it down. But, I mean, that would just make it even more spectacular. It'd have to be the 20 greatest of all time. You'd have to have Jones and GSP and, you know, the greatest fucking fighters of all time. I'm not going to leave that up to me to decide, but, 
you know, that would be the second insert set, guys. And the final insert set I would like, guys, of course, is the Atomic Refractors. Fuck yeah. I'm not even put my hands in the way because that is just too fucking mint. You know what I'm saying? Look at that shit. So that would be my last insert set, guys. Good luck picking 20 of the best fighters to fucking complete that set. Shit, yeah. This shit just got ripped. And next, guys, we're getting into the heaters of the set, the relics and autos. I mean, I don't think there's any room for any other relics in this set except for triple threads, baby, because, I mean, look at that bad ass. There is no other relic, in my opinion. These are the best relics I have ever seen in a UFC card set. So triple threads. Plus, guys, I don't want high serial numbers once we hit the relics and autos. So instead of being at $2.99 for all the uh, parallels and stuff, I want there just to be the base, then to $99, 50 25 10 and 1 plus the printing plates, of course. So that's what I would like my relics to look like. Yeah! For the autos, guys, I also want the 2018 museum design because of so much room to sign. I mean, then people like, you know, Dom, GSP, and Cejudo might get that son bitch on the fucking card. You know what I'm saying? What are you doing? And even with that big area, you give them at least a bigger sticker, you sons of bitches. So, it looks clean. It looks fucking, you see who the fighter is? No problem. And that nice stance, like a fighter stance, be when they're posing for like a promo or something. Looks good, guys. I also want the serial numbers to be low like the relics, except the one of one on the Super Fractor, I want... Silver ink, guys. Meaning the card would look somewhat like this, except on the museum card. <laughs> and of course, every set needs relic autos, guys. I mean, come on. These are some of the coolest looking relic autos around, so take your pick. Museum does some shit really, really well. P P Panini did too? I mean, uh, just too many fucking parallels. So I guess I'm looking for a set that looks like museum, doesn't have to be as thick, I um, mean, you know, lower numbers, uh, instead of having colors way up there, I want my uh, X-Fractors and Diamond Refractors to be the low serial numbered shit. Super Fractors, of course, look amazing, guys. And last but definitely not least, I want two autos and one relic per box at no more than 250 a box. Can I get a fucking... Oh, yeah! So pull your shit together. Whoever's taking this next uh, fucking adventure with sports cards. <clears throat> Tops. Let's fucking go. Anyway, guys, you guys want more Cloudsy420? Like, subscribe, and hit that bell, baby, because ding, ding. We's in the UFC and this some bitch, and I'm out. Peace. Losers always whine about their best. Winners go home and fuck the prom queen. <laughs>